Hey internet, Vlogmas day six. So we are up for a drive right now to run some errands. I think we traumatized Chris a little bit with Walmart, so he's staying home. He's gonna stay out of the action this time. Um, we're just gonna get groceries for a couple of days, buy some flip-flops for me because I had the really horrifying revelation that I didn't pack any flip-flops because I keep mine at the gym um, for when I have yoga and I completely forgot to take them home. So I need to buy some new ones, which which, you know, is not a tragedy. Hopefully they have some cute ones though at the mall. Um, so we're gonna do that. And then we are going to go on the wild goose chase that is finding a cute Christmas tree in Hawaii, which is extremely difficult. I'm still very torn over whether to get a fake one and then try and take it home or get a real one, but then we need to buy like a tree stand and all of that and it will have lights on it. So honestly, we'll just really kind of buy what we find because there's not that much selection. So, so today's a beautiful day and we have plans to go for a hike later as well which will be fun and I will take you guys along with me so we're at Foodland, and this is where it's at for poke the Whole Foods one is good too but it's way more expensive um, so I got a half a pound of this one the spicy mayo one and then the Hawaiian style is kind of like it tastes like chives and it's very like simple flavors which is good the avocado one is really good too if you guys come here but basically what I decided to do is to get the avocado separately and then we're gonna do rice and sliced avocado. So here is what I'm having for lunch. I got some fresh avocado which doesn't look very nice but it tastes delicious. I never know how to present it nicely. And then this is the spicy mayo ahi and then this is the Hawaiian style ahi with chives and I warmed up some rice from yesterday's dinner and then I will be eating mine with a fork like a savage and my boyfriend will eat it in a classy way with chopsticks. So we're about, what do you think, halfway up? Maybe a little bit more to Diamond Head. I told you guys we were gonna do a little bit of a hike today. So this is one, the one that's actually closest to us. We're planning on doing a bunch. Um, but since it was later in the day, we didn't wanna go too far from the apartment. So it's quite beautiful so far. It's a pretty easy hike to be honest compared to Canadian hikes, which can be very, very grueling. Um, the only hard part is the heat because it is about maybe, what do you think, 27 degrees? Yeah, something like that. So I thought I would show you guys the view so far, which is very pretty. Basically climbing a volcano. Fire. It's kind of cool. You go through this darkened tunnel, which is nice to cool you down. Um, I'll show you guys on the way down when I'm huffing and puffing a little bit less. But I wanted to show you this even better view, which is so pretty. The water and the waves, and down there on the left-hand side is the car park where we left the car. That we like have gotten this high, we're not even done yet, but that's just like the name of the game when you're hiking. It's kind of rough water around here. Yeah. So hopefully they've got like little coves or something like that. I think the boat's actually just going to be like. Did they tell you what kind of fishes you would see? Mm -hmm. They have lots of like sharks. Almost to the top. Check out the color of the water, it's so pretty. And then that's the other side that I just showed you. There's Honolulu. And then that's the top. Did it pretty fast. We made it! Look at this pretty view, it looks almost exactly the same as the one I just showed you. You should send some photos to your grandparents. These are gonna make like really good pictures. Yeah. Looks just like a postcard. Kind of trail. I'm not sure where they would expect you to go after this. So you're gonna try new routes over there because you have a death wish. That's probably as far as you can go. So I realized I forgot to show you guys the flip-flops I bought earlier. So these are from Island Soul, which is a chain that's pretty much in every mall in Hawaii. So I got these from Kahala Mall. Um, and I think they're so pretty. So these are Havaianas, and I pretty much only wear these flip-flops. I already have two pairs at home in purple and navy blue, but like I said, I forgot them both, which was a major fail. Um, so I got these ones, which I thought were so cute. They have the skinny bands, which I prefer, and then they have the black bottom, which is great because that 
won't get all dirty. I try and never get the ones that are like cream colored because I find that like if you step in anything remotely muddy this will soak it in and then it's really hard to get out. Um, so I really like the color of these. They're kind of like a rose gold. Well, maybe they pull more copper. They're like more of a copper color and then, then they have the very sort of subtle branding here and they're just really pretty and comfy so this is great for when I go to the pool later you just really need to have flip-flops on vacation so problem is solved so I just forgot I didn't end the vlog before I went swimming so my hair is a little wet but yeah I went and had a swim after the hike which is such a nice feeling just nice to cool down and um, not much else exciting happening tonight so I figured I would say goodnight and see you guys in Vlogmas Day 7. Bye! Alright, so here we are sitting in the hotel at their beach bar and I am having a Kahala sunset.